Seven adults and one in five children experience food insecurity here in Northwest Ohio. The Salvation Army has a food pantry on the front lines of the effort to change those numbers. 13 Action News reporter Lisa Guyton joins us live with more all new at 530. Lee and Christian, whether it's long term or short term help, the Salvation Army has been a part of helping feed those in need here in Northwest Ohio for more than a century. Leaders say the numbers are increasing and there's also been a bit of a shift when it comes to those who need that help. Sally's Market looks a lot more like a grocery store than a food pantry, and that is by design. My wife had this vision of creating a space where it literally looks like a market, and she wanted you know, a place that's going to bring dignity and hope for all that we serve. While the Salvation Army has had a food pantry at its downtown building for decades, it recently underwent a major overhaul, and the Sally's Market space opened last month. It's a newly renovated space, it's clean, it's well kept, our food is fresh. We are getting uh, anywhere from two to three shipments in per week uh, from, from different uh, places and suppliers. The market is open Monday through Thursday and it has been a busy place. We were seeing an average of about 60 to 80 families a week before we reopened and now we're seeing between 80 to 100 families of which we're seeing 12 to 15 new families every day that we're here Monday through Thursday. We're seeing a lot more working families than we've ever seen before. Sometimes people just need that little hand up uh, rather than just a handout and that's why the Salvation Army is here. Valentino Quinn is one of the people who have been given a hand up at Sally's Market and he appreciates the support from this life-changing place. Every Monday through Thursday, no matter what you got going on, you can always come here and get help from the Salvation Army. So, uh, you know, it's, it's gratefulness, thankfulness, gratefulness, and blessedness. And I think that's what this whole situation is about, giving thanks and always believing something that's higher than you because sometimes you can't do it on your own. There are a lot of different ways you can get involved with the work of Sally's Market. The Salvation Army is always in need of volunteers to help with things like restocking the shelves or working as a personal shopper for the people who may need a little extra help while they're there. Now, you can also donate food or money. We're going to post a link with all of the information along with our story on our webpage, which is, of course, 13abc.com. Lee? Lisa, thank you.